will resume the video. 1969 Chevelle. Ghost flames. You see the ghost flames? Yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Nice. You gotta love it. <laughs> Smooth ghost flames. I'm trying to convince Mrs. CW to put ghost flames on her Corvair. Ghost flames. 67 Chevelle Super Sport. Nova 396. Disc brakes, but no power. Manual brakes. Billet. Nitrous oxide. Holly or a Demon or something. Double pumper. 69 Camaro. Rumbly Trans Am. Z28 Rally Sport, looking pretty dead stock. Bet you everybody looks for the DZ block. Look at that high rise. Power brakes, power disc brakes, but no power steering. Looks like a survivor car. Gotta be from the west. It's a little too clean for around here. Rally Sport Z28. Pretty rare to order a fancy version of a high performance car with a halo vinyl top. That was new for 69. Jim Wangers had an article in the recent Muscle Reviews magazine, Muscle Car Reviews, Muscle Car, Muscle Reviews, geez, the Hemmings publication. And he was saying that the vinyl top was the most profitable item of any single option you could buy with the vinyl top. Four speed. First shifter with the sawtooth gauges. Nova 1967. 66. Looking good. 66. This is Chris. Bet you this thing Sixty-five, four forty-two, four hundred, four-barrel dual exhaust. Originally, it was a three-thirty, so it stood for four-speed, four-barrel dual exhaust. This one's got an automagic F eighty-five Cutlass, looking in pretty good shape. Four forty-two, red lines and super stock wheels. Nice car. Thank you. What a beauty. I had a 67 a long time ago and my neighbor had a 66. It was only a few years old. He put heads on it. Beat the crap out of it. Then he got it, traded it in for a Willys Jeep. Beat the crap out of that. Dumped the transmission on the ground. Ford. Flip front end with a small block Chevy. Gasser, 55. Chevrolet. I wonder what racing history this baby has. Studebaker GT Gran Turismo. Air conditioned. Studebaker GT Grand Turismo Raymond Lowey Design Any direction you look at, any direction, there's always something to see. We don't need no stinking hood to drive around. There she is. Pile of junk. Into a beautiful hot rod truck.
parking lot is full. Ford Starliner, 406 with three twos, of course. Header exhaust manifolds. High performance was something they did even before the GTO. The GTO just took the smaller body. That's about the only difference. What a beauty. Bubble top style. Old school American racing mags, tulip spokes. Nice color. Bet you this thing flies. Hear those cicadas? Cold air induction, tow bar brackets. Small block, 289 probably. Fairlane 500, 302. A little bit newer engine. Sports coupe. Dearborn steel tubing. Like those flat caps? I've got a few of those bags that I've had for an awful long time. Moon Eyes tachometer. I've got a few of those too. I like those center caps. Perfectly ground to match the wheel. Beautiful job. Somebody's a nice, nicely skilled machinist. Like that style Ford shoebox. Got a whole bunch of them. Better get some videos before the sun goes down. 1950. Sledhead, Southern Indiana. Look at this slam, baby. Road Rockets, Indianapolis. Tom Culberton, Bailey Watson, Gene Winfield, Junior Brown, Bo Hopkins. Route 66. Oh, I like those Stuart Warner gauges. Never seen those gauge pods before. I thought I'd seen a lot. 